Right, so the question was how do I attach uh, wood panels or wood to the aluminum extrusion? Well, there's a couple ways I do this. Uh, I don't know what other people do, but this is how I do it. And I can show you exactly uh, what kind of uh, hardware we, I'm using. And if you want to do the same. So one of them is, this is the, uh, let me see. It's the uh, stainless steel corner brace. This is a, a half inch by half inch. Okay. Get this screw up. It's like this. It's a 90 degrees angle brace, right? And uh, it's a strong. It's a um, stainless steel. And then this. This is a. Um, if I'm using this, where it is thin like this, I'm using an eight millimeter this is m5 uh uh button head uh hex nut and it's yeah eight millimeter and then there are two things also i'm using a oops, it's hard to see this is a drop in uh uh t nut okay a drop in because this in this case uh, you don't have a place to slide in through the aluminum extrusion this thing can just fit in you can just insert it and then turn it it, it goes sideways and it locks if you can screw it so insert that there on one side and then there okay so this eight eight millimeter uh, screw for this kind, okay, and I'm using a ten millimeter. If I'm using this aluminum extrusion angle brace, okay, because this thing is thicker. I can show you a couple example like how I did it here. Take a look. Here we go, you can see one side is the uh, nut, the M5, and one side is just a half inch screw, which is like this, you can get it from Home Depot. Okay, number eight, half inch, it's very sharp. Yeah, if I'm using a half inch wood like this, my screw is it's a half inch those were the two angles that I'm using okay now that is only if you have access to screw the board from the inside right you yeah you put the uh, ankle right here and then you screw it from the inside what if there's something here and you don't have access to screw from inside um, what you can do is using the same angle like this okay you put the beam the wood beam across from here to here with these ankle braces to the beam the, the wood and then your panel you will have to uh, screw it use a screw to screw to the wood so uh, yeah you can attach that from that side that's when you have to screw in uh, that's the only uh, time that I I put the wood beam across here so I can use the screw I don't have to drill into the aluminum extrusion yeah there's a way like that you can do but uh, it's up to you if you want to do the same I will list the the link uh, the all the material the link of all the materials that I mentioned here in a link below you can check it out And this is the angle brace. Closer look. They come uh, 
insulator and like this you just peel it off to get to the uh, stainless steel finish you can see this is my cabinet but but uh, bottom and see I'm using that and this is also another angle that I'm using uh, stainless steel this is two inches uh, aluminum I mean a uh, uh, stainless steel touch to that and touch that to the wall here's a perfect example you can see I don't have access to screw the the panel from the outside I put that cross beam right here now I can screw into it